nice and dirty. Uh, there's a vibration mount there. You can all see that. It's pretty hard. It's just a wee black rubber ring. Yeah. Okay, which dampens the vibrations. There's another one here. And there'll be another one, hopefully, in here, or a rubber grommet. Um, that stops you from getting worn out too, too quickly. It stops the chainsaw from getting worn out. Mm -hmm. And uh, fatigue's just one of the worst things. You can make bad judgment when you're fatigued. So how can you tell if they're worn out? When, when it's not, when it's not uh, dampening properly. Okay. Um, yeah. When it sort of slops, it'll feel like that feels sort of spongy. Yeah. Um, when the rubber perishes, they'll, it'll just sort of feel dead. Oh. Um, it won't sort of spring back. It might, it might feel like it's hitting, hitting um, plastic on plastic or metal on metal. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I guess you'll feel stronger vibrations on your arms. Sorry? Thing. I guess you will feel much stronger vibrations on your arms. Oh, I definitely, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Um, one thing that that stuffs the vibration mounts quicker is incorrect sharpening as well. If it's It'll vibrate with the if these have been if the depth gauge has been taken down too far, but um, I won't I won't push it too tight because it's too tight. These are the Polytex chainsaws. Um, they're in pretty good condition, but dirty. Um, oops, oops.